Hey guys, this is JR from DIYPrepper.com and um, one of the most useful features on a Swiss Army knife is the can opener. Victorinox has two types of can openers and the one that you have will depend on the knife model that you're using. Um, the first type of can opener is this one. It's the one most commonly found on Swiss Army knives. It has a can opener with a screwdriver tip and that is suitable for both small flathead as well as Phillips head screws. Uh, this one is a little bit different from other multi-tool can openers in that it opens the can using a forward cutting motion. Uh, it can also be used to create a drain hole like the can openers uh, used to open cans of condensed milk. It isn't terribly easy to do, but if you make two kind of triangular plunge cuts like this, kind of meet up, it'll create a hole similar to the one that that, uh, that that other type of can opener makes. And so you can get juices out. This one isn't gonna do a really good job of it just because this is a uh, fruit cocktail. And uh, <laughs> there's a lot of chunkies in the way of the juices, but on things like condensed milk, it'll work just fine. That way you don't have to open up the entire can to get to the juices. Okay, so with things that are just liquid, That'll, that'll work much, much better. Uh, but to open a can using this type of can opener, place the hook underneath the lip of the can and then just make small forward cutting motions. Okay, don't try to do a, a motion that's too big. Otherwise, uh, you'll probably like miss a spot, which will make opening the can a little bit more difficult. But just go around. As you can see, once you kind of have a, uh, once you kind of get into a groove and know what you're doing, opening a can with this type of can opener is pretty easy. And then just use the tip, and then fold the fold the edge back, and then you're good. Um, now, one thing I always like to do when using this type of can opener, especially, it's good to do with any type of can opener, but wipe off the edge with a. Um, with a cloth or something, that way you get rid of those metal shavings because there might be some uh, and you don't want to ingest those. Okay. The second type of can opener found on Swiss Army knives is the combination tool. Okay, And this is a can opener, bottle opener, screwdriver, and wire stripper all in one. It combines the can opener that we discussed a second ago with this bottle opener here. Okay, so it combines the functionality for all of those into one tool. Um, this one is more similar to can openers found on other types of multi-tools like Leatherman in that it opens the can using a backward cutting motion. So to open a can using this tool, do the same thing that you did earlier with the other one. You place the hook underneath the lip of the can and then you do small plunge cuts. Okay, and you wanna be careful not to try to cut too much at once or go too deep otherwise the uh, the tool will get stuck in the can and you'll have to kind of wiggle it out and if you have to do that every time that you make a cut then that can that can be kind of difficult and kind of frustrating and any time that you use either one of these can openers you want to be close to the edge Okay, you don't want to be towards the middle because that'll cause the metal to flex more than it needs to and that'll make cutting harder. That's a problem that I see a lot of people have when they try to use one of these can openers and they don't do it very often or they've never done it before is they will try to uh, go kind of further towards the middle of the can instead of staying at the edge and that makes their life much more difficult when they are trying to cut these. Okay, so that's how you use um, both of these types of can openers on Swiss Army knives, and um, you can use kind of the same techniques that I use for this one on other multi-tools, things like Leatherman's, even old uh, Winger Swiss Army knives. Uh, so anyway, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Please hit like and subscribe. Thank you.